Court of Owls is watching. From inside of Gotham's walls. They lurk in every shadow. And they rule you. One and all. The nursery rhyme was scary enough. How long have you known the court's real, Talia? When I was still part of the League, we observed the court's growth in Gotham. Now you can see the city's rotten core. They're mining an element called Dionysium. Its makeup is similar to Lazarus Pit samples. A foul substitute for the true miracle. A contaminated extract. For centuries, the court has been looking for a fountain of youth. Instead, they found the makings of undying monsters. The Talons. So they're using Dionysium to make soldiers. I wonder why the League doesn't give the court the good stuff. They would probably pay a lot for a Lazarus pit. Even in their current debased state, the League would never descend to such banality. And the Court's greed and corruption prevent them from ever mastering the secrets of the Lazarus Pits. I mean, the League creates monsters too. Look at your father. Oh, those are some harsh words. Would you say your friend Jason? is a monster as well. Of course that was you. Jason never asked you to bring him back like that, Talia. I suppose gratitude was too much to expect in exchange for another stab at life. You wouldn't dare use the word gratitude if you knew what he's been through. With Bruce gone, the court's operation grows. The League of Shadows will raise Gotham to the ground unless you silence the court. So if we take down the court, the League will just let Gotham be? <laughs> Without Batman, everyone's making their moves. I'm just wondering what yours is. I'll do what I can to distract the League. And your path to the Court of Owls will be clear. This must be how Montoya feels. <laughs>